Hey guys, happy Saturday to everyone. Look what we have here. We have a little June bug. I just had to come on. It wouldn't be a nice weekend for me if I couldn't spend a little bit of time with this gorgeous baby. <laughs> So we are back and June is, we're hanging out in my office because again, the weather, like the sun is coming and going, but um, not getting great lighting in my nursery. So here we are. I do want to get an, a little chair for her for in the nursery, like a baby size chair because she sits in chairs so like adorably. And I just think she poses so <laughs> sweet. But um, just wanted to take some time today, spend with her. I'm still having a boatload of fun with new outfits that have been arriving for her slowly but surely. She is currently wearing this beautiful jockety set, which you can't see that she's got little pink bloomers with a bow tie in the front on underneath. Um, there you can see sort of the white peeking out underneath the swing top so it is meant to be like it's a bloomy dress like swing top but it is meant to show the bloomers um and it's this lovely beautiful shade of pink it's a nice pale pink with the gorgeous petal well is it a petal sort of petal collar but yet a little different <laughs> but it's so pretty on her she's just got a pair of little white knee high socks on because it has started to cool down here a little bit but still warming up during the day, but fall is definitely on its way here for sure. And she's just playing with this sweet little kitty. It's actually a cat stuffed toy that I got from uh, Jimboree back in the day. And I have like matching sets to match, <laughs> like sleepers that have the cat motif on it. And yeah, that was the cat that went with the set. But um, she's just looking so pretty in this outfit. I love it. And the top is actually a six to 12 month size. And then the bloomers I got in the 12 month size, which is like 12 to 18 months, just because she's got such big thighs. Um, and they seem to fit like perfectly. If the top were any smaller, it would not fit her because her arms are so chubby. And luckily the, um, at the wrists, at the opening of the armholes and the blouse, uh, they are buttoned, so they open up even more, so it makes it easier to get her open hand, this hand through without any stress or strain on the kit itself or the vinyl. Um, but I'm just thoroughly enjoying growing her wardrobe because I'm starting fresh. I had nothing for a doll of this size. And let me tell you guys, I've got some more things coming. I've got a bunch that's here. Let me know if you're curious and would like to see um, some like, you know, June's clothing haul or start to her wardrobe. If you are interested, I will share um, some of the beautiful things that I've gotten for her. If you're not interested, let me know as well, because I know some people like to see haul videos. I know some don't necessarily love them, um, but I, I am having so much fun dressing this size baby because she fits into all the cute, really um, stylish for baby looks that I just swoon over, but can't necessarily put Monroe in because it, she's just too young of a baby for the look that a lot of these are. And, or, and, or, um, I can't get in Monroe's size anyways, because she's just, she's a newborn size. And um, ultimately it's more suitable for a baby this size because that's what I would be in and what I did dress my babies, my own children in when they were a little bit older. You know, newborns do mostly end up in comfort, comfort, comfortable. <laughs> I'm trying to say two words there. Comfortable you know, a lot of sleepers, a lot of onesies, a lot of things that make it easier for them to sleep in because that's what they do most of their time when they're newborns. But by this age, they're very active and they're, you know, starting to toddle around. And by seven months, um, my youngest daughter, Lexi, actually was pulling up and she walked it just, just around a little over eight months. Very young to be a walker, but putting shoes on her and things like that I was doing at that age and she was such a quick to walk and she was just always on the go from a very young age. Um, <clears throat> so 
it's easier to dress a baby in like those bigger baby clothes and real cute put together outfits and not living in sleepers when they're this size. And she is like the perfect size, like her length slash height and her chubbiness. She just really suits those really sweet outfits. Um, so I'm having a lot of fun and trying to figure out what accessories and or toys or like, you know, furniture, like a little chair for in the nursery for her to pose for pictures and for videos. I'm trying to figure all that out because I know that's a big part of the fun for me. And so I definitely want to get some things for her. So I'm working on that. But let me know if you do want to see her wardrobe as it comes in because I've got a lot of things coming in right now. I'm finding that she is so cute in hats though, you guys. Like the cutest in hats. Oh my gosh. Y'all didn't tell me how fun this was. <laughs> Why didn't you tell me how fun it is to have a bigger baby? <laughs> But no, I'm really embracing the process and embracing bonding with her. I'm having boatloads of fun with her. I just, I think she's adorable. I really do. She's a lot of fun. Um, and hopefully you guys are enjoying seeing her. And thank you for all the lovely comments on my videos with her. It's, you guys are just so sweet. <laughs> and it's nice that you are all enjoying this you know, new, the, this newness in my nursery and kind of along for the ride with me. It's, it's a lot of fun. It's a lot of fun. Um, and this week, unfortunately, I didn't have, other than the video I spent um, making with her, I really didn't have any time to spend with her all week because my work week was absolutely nuts. So just being able to, you know, fuss about and change her and just try things on her and make a little video of her. Like, it's just, it's wonderful downtime for me this weekend. It's much needed, let's put it that way, because it, it's been utter chaos. And we also have had a lot of work happening at our house this week. So I, you know, again, with, you know, having people come and go, things happening inside and outside, like it makes my world feel upside down. So I can come back to this beautiful little baby. I shouldn't say little, beautiful big baby and just enjoy some time to myself because nobody's in the house. My daughter who was staying here has officially moved out into her in, into her new apartment. And so I have peace on the weekends here and I am loving it. Absolutely loving it. So there you go, guys. Not a super long video, um, but do let me know if you do want to see some of her outfits or if you're interested in seeing all of the outfits, like there's, there's quite a bit. Um, or I can just highlight some of my favorite things, but you'll definitely see her in things, but you probably won't see her in everything because I won't make a video of every time I change her, of course. Um, and, uh, and I will get back to sharing more of Monroe. She has since been changed out of her outfit I had her in last weekend um, and back into more baby-ish swaddled because it got really cold here. It was like down to 40 something, uh, not last night, but the night before. And, Oh, the chill in the air is already occurring. It makes me so sad. Um, however, I love the outfits for it. And oh my gosh, wait, one more thing I have to share with you. The coats that will fit this baby. The adorable little coats. Oh my gosh, the stylish little coats. Because little, little like baby size swing coats, little dressy swing coats are the cutest. I love the look of them and they're great over like little dresses, which she has some of. Um, and just picture it with like tights and little proper shoes. Like she's just a proper little lady. The fun of it, you guys, it's ridiculous. I'm still just reeling it, the cuteness that this baby is and everything that goes with it. So I'm totally having a lot of fun, as you can tell. <laughs> I am slowly, um, I didn't have time this week to look for some channels. I know that a couple of people commented of where people do have, which channels do have toddlers that they have in their collections. So I am going to slowly seek them out because I'm on this, oh, this fun, bigger baby slash toddler kick that I just, I want to see what everybody else does with theirs. And, you know, I just having a lot of fun. I have to say, but there's little Miss June, little Junie, <laughs> little Junie bug. 
having so much fun with her, you guys. And hopefully you're not sick of seeing her yet. I will do a details video of her, but oh my gosh, I'm just in love. I'm in love. Who knew I needed a baby this size? Someone did somewhere. <laughs> Anyways, guys, I hope you're having a great weekend so far, and you will see us very, very soon. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.